Usually when you see Summer McIntosh and Katie Ledecky in the same A final, it's the 400 freestyle, but this is the 200 butterfly. We're throwing all rules out the window. Summer McIntosh, the world junior record holder, fastest in the world last year at a 205.20. She was 208.24 this morning. And right off the bat, she's out fast. 207, it's 27 rather, 76 for the Canadian national record holder, world junior record holder. And reigning world champion, the 16-year-old from the Sarasota Sharks continues to just Dazzles so many with that young speed, as does Bella Sims, the 17-year-old in lane six. She's got a bunch of hardware to her name as well. Sims out in a 101.41, about a second and a half faster than her prelim swim. And if she keeps that pace up, she's going to go at best time. Her personal best at 211.42. The pro swim record. A 206.11 owned by Haley Flickener of Sun Devil Swimming. Summer McIntosh, 1.0025 on that first 100 meters. 131.94 at that turn. And right now, she's under U.S. Open record pace. Summer McIntosh absolutely flying here in this A final. Three and a half seconds between her and the rest of the field. The U.S. Open record is a 205.85, pro swim record 206.11. Both of those are very much in danger. McIntosh capable of finishing incredibly fast. Is that what she has in store for us tonight? Summer McIntosh winning the heat and setting a new U.S. Open. New. Pro swim record, and ladies and gentlemen, a new world junior record for Summer McIntosh. The old record a 205.20, the new one a 205.05. Breaking the U.S. Open Pro Swim record, Canadian record, and World Junior record. Bella Sims finishing in second, 209.89. She absolutely obliterated her best time by over a second and a half, getting under that 210 mark, and she is the third fastest, fourth fastest, rather, woman in the world this year. And a 211.00 for Maria Jose Matacoco finishing in third. Ladies and gentlemen, setting, breaking her own world junior record once again, your 200 butterfly champion, Summer McIntyre.